Good morning, everybody. I'm supposed to be a blessing. This is my reading for my kings and my queens, my lovely Leos. If you're new to my channel, I'm supposed to be a blessing. Please like, subscribe, comment, share my videos, and tell people about Miss Bless. That being said, to all my other subscribers, hi, y'all. Let's get it. <laughs> See how the world cards. You're definitely sucking out of one thing, going into another here. It needs to be new beginnings. I also see that you've been isolating yourself to think about people, places, and things within your life to come up with answers that you need. <clears throat> All right now. Shit. But like somebody need to say something because my throat got kind of like, like shit. Couldn't speak for a minute. Okay, so say what you mean and mean what the fuck you say. It is what it is. What else is going on? Eight of fires. The eight of wands. It's saying that. Mm-hmm. Some of y'all feeling trapped, but I'm you kind of trapped in your own mind in regard to some things that are taking place within your life, but you need to cycle out of one thing going to another. I do see financial increase on the horizon for you guys, and I do feel as though like this is the eight of airs. The eight of airs. Like, let me get it right, y'all. Mm. Eight of airs is the thoughts. So you definitely your thoughts in regard to some shit. The eight of wands is what? You're worried about some fucking bullshit. Let the shit go. It is what it is. These cards here, y'all. Anyway, it's saying, Leo's, that you are the one. Shit. We know we the one. We don't need you to tell us we the one. We are the one. Hey. <laughs> seven of waters is seven of cups. It's saying that there's plenty of offers going to be coming your way. So it's sending you to expect the unexpected here. That's a good thing. The explorer says you want to jump out and do something new on the side, and that's the food card in this deck. I said the universe is ready to bless you. Are you ready to receive it? Say, so standing your strength in regard to everything that's going on in your life. And then you're waiting on some finances. You are ready to plan it. Now let it grow. You will reap your harvest. It's going to be coming in for you guys. I do feel as though it's a very, very creative time for you guys. <clears throat> Excuse me, you guys. You have a star. This is a wish card as well. So it's saying that some things need to balance out within your life. The eight of Earth is the eight of Pentacles. Time you've been working extremely hard on something. Could be going back to school and things of that sort. And that's a good thing. The moon card lies deception and deceit. Secrets. Anything that's in the dark will definitely come to the light. You could be dealing with the Pisces or Cancer here. It is what it is. But just trust them, believe in your intuition, and you will never be led astray. Somebody is dealing with addiction here. Whether they're drinking too much, whatever. Anything that you're doing too much of, you got to let that shit go. Get a grip on that shit. You're definitely weighing your options in regard to some things that are taking place. So you could be addicted to a person as well. Let me go back to that obsession and things of that sort. All right, now. Get on back onto the flow. You're weighing your options in regard to some. You're trying to balance some shit out. You're trying to come up with an answer that you need. All right, and you have the Ten of Waters. All right, emotional fulfillment and happiness is here. And I see that you're going to be meeting some things head on here, my lovely Leos. Yes, you are. There's a lover's relationship here that you're definitely thinking about. And that's a great thing. A new love is coming in on the rise. And just follow your intuition in regard to the high pieces. She sits high, she looks low. She don't talk much. And some of y'all got to be like that too. Don't tell all your business. Whatever you're trying to manifest here with the mod, don't tell everybody. Trust and believe the supernatural is at work. And some of you lie. Some of y'all lie. What the hell? I'm talking about you lie. My English teacher would have a fit. The Empress card is here. So if somebody's birthing on some new exciting things, somebody could be pregnant here. You could be dealing with the Aries here as well. I see here you're walking away from people placing things that no longer serve because they can't go on with you to your next level. No way. Hmm. You're going to be playing some seeds. It's definitely going to go for you because it's a very creative time. I see here... You need to make a head of a hard decision in regard to someone or something. You could be definitely dealing with the cancer here. Or you could be definitely dealing with the Libra. Needing balance in that light. All right. Celebration is definitely coming in on the horizon. Um, you could be dealing with the Scorpio, Scorpio here. Or Scorpio could be coming towards you. Somebody's stuck. They're not moving forward or backwards in the guard to something with the swinging ones. The Ten of Pentacles said financial increase is definitely on the horizon for you guys. And then you have um, the Three of Fires. It's the Three of Wands. Your ships is coming in on the horizon. You could definitely be dealing with the Aries or Aries could be coming towards you. <clears throat> Transformation, which is another Scorpio card. Endings but new beginnings. It is what it is. You're going to be very victorious here is what I'm seeing. My lovely Leo. See, happiness is on the horizon. Just trust and believe in yourself. Because wish fulfillment is at hand with the nine of waters. Okay? Thank you, guys. <laughs>